AutoGeek.net has everything you need to keep your vehicle looking its best. Mothers, Meguiar's, Wolfgang, Diamond Eye, 3M, Pinnacle, and more. AutoGeek.net carries over 60 brands. AutoGeek's selection is huge, our prices are low, our expert staff can answer any question you have, and we ship right to your door. AutoGeek.net. We are car care. Hey, welcome back to AutoGeek.net and Helping in the Heartland. We're coming to you live again from Lincoln, Nebraska. And you can see we've got all hands on deck right about now as we are making some real progress on the 69 AMX. Now, Mike, like you said, man, he has been right on. You know, he's got the doors done, he's got the trunk, he's got the fenders, and he has got the hood. That stuff was all knocked out. And, you know, you're as calm and cool as could be. Because I was starting to get a little worried that we'd never get to the shell. But, man, you've got to the shell since the last time we've been alive, yep. and you have knocked out a ton of the grunt work, so to speak, yep, like yep. really coming together. Yeah, it's coming together good. We've got almost all the hand sanding and, and machine sanding has been done to the roof. Okay, so we'll start at the top, work our way down, and most of the rest of the shell has been knocked out with the thousand grit, and now we're going back over everything with fifteen hundred, and then after that, we're going to hit the side panels by machine. And so, okay, so we'll get the sanding, then hit the machine. Yep. Now, the tough spot is these uh, radiuses we've had in the back window here. Now, something you're a little concerned about because it's tough to get in those spots without taking off the edges. That's right. They're they're curved. They got a real sharp curve to them all the way back, and so you got to get in there and just gently roll your tube and sand them out and get them all smoothed out. And uh, so it just takes a little bit of finesse, a little bit of time. You got to watch what you're doing. We got a little more experience in those areas here. But what's something I want to point out to you guys is talk about this being a family affair, right? You know, it's pass on generation. We're doing this for the doctor's son, and you know, basically a son, so to speak, to the doctor. But check these guys out. Man, we've got everybody in it here today. We've got Zachary here and Cameron. You guys are wet sanding. Do you even know what that is? Yeah. What are we doing here with the sandpaper right now? Sanding. Yeah. Are you guys having fun? Yeah. It looks like you guys are doing an awesome job, man. That is shiny. You can almost see. Can you see your face in that? Not yet. When you can see it, you smile. Okay. Does that mean you're doing a good job? Got it. Okay. What do you think of Daddy's project? A lot of work. Yeah? Cool. Is it too much work, you think? No. No? All right. What do you think? Do you think you ever want to get behind a race car like this someday? Mm -hmm. What about you, buddy? Yeah. yeah? All right. Well, you guys keep working. It's awesome to have him here. Now, we've got a couple other friends that have come to support the cause here. We've got Tony here. He's supervising everybody today, man. <laughs> Giving a little uh, inspiration, so to speak. Dwayne over in the back. We, you know, he wasn't intent on sitting and watching, but, man, Wes drug him up here, and he's been hard at it for the last hour and a half. A couple camera shy guys off to the sides. Doug, you know, you, he waved to me from off the camera, which is good. And we've got the, the uh, other son, one of the other sons of the doctor as well, hiding off camera. So come around here west, man. Talk to me. What are we thinking so far? Oh, right now it's looking pretty good. I think we're going to be able to uh, call it a day, probably around 5. Just in time for supper, hopefully. Man, I'm going to tell you, yesterday about this time, I figured there was no way we were getting this thing done. But you guys are really coming together and as a team, man. Knock this thing out. It's kudos to Mike Phillips, man. I mean, uh, Mike's not one to sit around, and he realizes that, you know, he knew what it took to get this done, and that's why we went to him. I mean, uh, he's been a savior in this deal, and not only that, we've all learned so much. You know, this good technique and how it's supposed to be done. Very cool, very cool. Now, I'm going to run around here to the other side and catch up with Ben, you know, is our one of our foreign members who's been through the long haul and basically done this as a learning experience. So, Ben, at this point, what have you learned? Um, actually, yeah, just what it, what it takes, actually, to uh, complete. One of these cars, I mean, on a custom paint. So starting with 1,000 grit, going to 15 to 3,000, all the way to uh, 5,000. Now, you're just a hobbyist, am I right? Correct. You just do it for the fun of doing it? Yeah, typically just simple compound polish and, and wax. So it's the first time I've ever wet sanded. All right, Mike, the expert. Give him a grade. Uh, a plus. Nice. E easy. Wow. Uh, a plus for effort and A plus for results. I I'm going to tell you, he can be pretty tough, man. I, there's a few yeah. times I had him show me a few things at Sea Line. He's slapped my hand away many a time, told me what I was doing wrong. So that's a, that's a, a big plus coming from Mike. Yeah, all, all the guys have actually worked really hard. And, uh, uh, you know, there's the only time we've ever taken a break is when it's just to get a, catch your breath, eat something, uh, get some liquids down you, you know, because we're all in here sweating hard. But uh, everybody's just been working real hard. And, uh, I think the results are going to show it. 
All right, when we come around back here, I want to check in with Paul one last time. Paul, yes. What's what's the word, man? What are you working on here in this back quarter panel? Just catching some of the orange peel that uh, has been missed. Okay. And uh, just trying to get it uh, get it down. Just having fun. Are you over it at this point, or are you still trucking on through? Oh, yeah, this is all right. I'm here till Monday. Look at this guy sweating, and he's doing it for the love of, for the love of polishing, man. Thanks for coming out. Uh, no problem. I'm well, glad to be here. All right, well, one thing you guys haven't seen is that between the scenes of us going live, we've been working on a video that will come up on autogeek.net. You can check the forums, and it's going to tie everything all together. And uh, one of our, our guys, Yancey, here, who's put this whole production together, will be uh, formatting that. So that will be a nice, concise way you can kind of watch this whole project unfold. That'll be coming out before the holidays. Hopefully by then, our boy Wes will have this project completed, and we will have the final footage of where we hand this over to uh, the doctor and his son. We can actually reveal the doctor's name at that point because we won't be giving anything away. Wes, man, final thoughts for me because I've got to leave here shortly to catch a flight back to Chicago because for me it's all about my family before I head out for my next job next week. What have you got? What are your thoughts on everything that's transpired the last day and a half? Oh, it's just been phenomenal. Phenomenal effort from everybody. Oh, just uh, pitching in, you know. The ben and I from yeah. North Coast Custom, we would have been doing this ourselves. But, you know, like I said, we uh, we wanted the, the best person pants. we knew to do the job. And I, the I thought Mike Phillips was, so I sent him a personal invitation. He comes out. and Did you think he was going to respond? I, Mike's a good guy. Just plain hard. I mean, uh, you know, his dedication to the craft is what impressed me the most that made me want to seek his knowledge and him coming out. You know, I had a 50-50 chance, wow, you know, this may be, you know, out of reach, but it just shows how human he is. I mean, he's he's just like us. He gets up every day, puts his pants on, he goes to work, you know, and that's awesome. you got to love that. Guy came a long way, all the way from uh, southern Florida to Nebraska to be a part of this, man. I, I think everybody might give a round of applause. Everybody's a part of it here today. You know, he gave a lot of knowledge, a lot of time, and a lot of times people might overlook, you know, his uh, generosity, but uh, we really appreciate everything you've done, Mike. I do. Believe it or not, I learn a lot from from you. You know, this isn't my wheelhouse, man, so sure. I, I'm taking notes along the way, and I appreciate it, man. I really yeah. do. Well, it's, this is my passion, so it's a pleasure to be here, Wes. Thank you for inviting us. Uh, we can't say enough, Mike. I think it's going to... Gonna earn you the right to a Nebraska T-bone steak tonight. <laughs> hot hey, that sounds good to me. Hey, you guys, this is my last live feed, but Mike's gonna be back with you guys at five o'clock for one last one. At that point, I think they'll be close to wrapping thing everything up. That's right. We should have everything completely through the polishing process and wrapped up and ready to go out to dinner. All right, we've got some sponsors I want to thank for my last time here. The guys from Menzerna, of course, Max from AutoGeek.net. Max, man, we're hopefully doing you proud. We've got the guys at Flex Lake Country Pads. You know, Ben's here representing his company, No Coast uh, Custom Rod Shop. Obviously, Wes is always representing Pro Headers and uh, the guys from 3M Car Care from all the abrasives. And to those little guys right there, man, wave a big can oh, 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 goodbye to the guys at camera all over the country watching you guys. And appreciate you joining us for our live feeds here from Lincoln, Nebraska. You guys have a good day and uh, come back again. Check with Mike at 5. Appreciate it. Let's get back to work, guys.